encoder here and I am just showing you my panel setup that I'm trying to use to mine Bitcoin on uh, using a basic miner to mine Bitcoin and then this is my two 300 watts uh, mono solar panels uh, equaling to 600 watts right now in the sun and I'm doing this video because the sun is at its peak right now it's very hot right now and shiny so then I'm trying to do this video to see if I would power the miners yeah so this is how I wired my cables through here into that hole into the ceiling and then to my uh, yeah. charge controller I'm in the room right now and that is my uh, MPPT solar charge controller and these wires are actually bringing in the solar from uh, the roof you can see it it's coming out of the ceiling and I showed you the solar panel feeding it uh, into the ceiling the wires into the ceiling only that only the only thing is that wires were red and these ones are black because I used the red wires and then I had to extend I didn't really do the measurement well that's my mistake and then I had to extend the wires and I used the black wires to extend it to the uh, charge controller so this is the charge controller and it's fully charged you can see power is not going from the solar panels to the battery but when I turn on the minus you see the solar starting to charge the batteries again so this is it from the solar panel from the solar charge controller from the panel to the charge controller and from the charge controller to the battery and these are two battery making a battery bank of 100 ah each 200 ah battery bank and then to a 12 volt 12 volt to 230 volt power inventor actually a 2000 VA that is a 2000 watt power inventor peak power and that's one of my problem with the miner actually I'll go into that later and this is my uh, how they call it this is my fuse my AC fuse and this is my AC switch that carries the wire of the miner minus block all the way into the mining uh, PSU and this is the miner this is an e-byte uh, miner Chinese miner I have the bitmain miners over there and I have some CPU and GPU miners over there also I'm not running the bitmain miners because I have uh, these miners are pretty old and they draw a lot of power actually the, the bitmain ones but this e-byte is a uh, kind of new I wouldn't say new it's also old but it's better than the bitmain ones compared to the power consumption I've already run some experiments with this and if you look closely you can see that i'm only using two hatch boards right now i was experimenting with all the hatch board i don't want to make this video long so i was experimenting with all the hard bo hash boards and i saw that the power inventor was actually going off 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 and i realized that it is uh, the power consumption of the psu the power supply uh, this power supply actually draws about uh yeah, it draws uh, 1,600 watts, and this is a thousand. Uh, this is a 2,000 watts inventor peak power. So I'm not even supposed to be doing half like a thousand. No, I'm not even supposed to be doing that to it if I want to keep it, and I want to make it last long. So I'm just running two hash balls to see if it work because I tried it already and uh, all the hash balls didn't work. So I will just borrow and borrow this. And put inside here, and then let me try and uh, power this one. Okay, let me power it on. Here first, the inventor is on, and then I just powered it on. You can hear the miner. You know. Yeah, so right now you can hear the miner. The miner has started running. I will give it some time to run, and uh, when it starts hashing, I would actually record that also. Let's look at the panel. You can see it has actually reduced, and the panel is now charging the battery. So I would wait for a minute or two, and then when it starts hashing. Yeah, so the, the miner is hatching right now on solar and you can see 
that is a that is about three four three point four terahashes uh, and the minor is about thirty three uh, degrees Celsius hot. Yeah, this red light is just telling us this red over here. I'll show you on the minor. That's the red light over there. It's just telling us that we have not plugged all uh, the hash boards inside. So it's only some hash boards that are running because of uh, the power consumption issues or because of uh, the inventor not being able to handle uh, the power, the full power that this power supply would draw. That is a thousand six hundred watts at peak would draw to power the whole miner uh, this inventor is actually not being able to produce that power so that's the power cable from the miner to the ground connected to the switch and this switch goes into that fuse and the fuse is going into the inventor and the inventor to the battery and you can see on the charge controller you can see on the charge controller the the solar panel is actually charging the battery right now because the, the inventor has drawn a lot of uh, power from the battery you can see it just changed to six seven uh, according to how how the sun is up there i'm not outside i don't know how the sun is shining but you can see that the solar panel is charging the battery as we are mining and then one thing i want to say about this whole setup is this whole setup works when the sun is up when it's in the afternoon when the sun is actually up that is when this whole setup work man. i would like to say if you have not subscribed to this channel yet please please sorry for me shouting i think the miner is uh, a bit loud so please please take the time to subscribe to my channel hit the notification bell and like this video and share this video it actually means the world to me to share this video Share this video so that other people can see it. It will motivate me to do more. I think I would like to add more panels and more battery so that I can run this miner fully and then I can run these other two miners. Uh, this motherboard I have over there, I'll use it to run a node. Uh, I'm using this small one and run this, like run almost all my crypto stuff off solar. That is what I'm thinking of doing so please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell like this video it means the world to me when you like my videos yeah so this is an ASIC running on solar uh, power and uh, let me check the hash rate again yeah I think the hash rate will go up gradually it will gradually go up uh, this miner actually is hashing about 13 tera hashes yeah the second 13 tera hashes per second and it has four hash bots inside i'm using only two hash bots so i think this hash rate will just go up uh, i'm mining to my binance binance pool because when i mine to binance pool uh i get i do pool savings and then i get interest on my bitcoin that i mine so i'm mining straight to my binance Pool. If you're watching this video, you want to start mining. If not joined Binance Pool yet, consider using my link below in the description to register to Binance. Now, 